Hello guys, welcome to Mirian TV. This is Mirian and today guys I have a very special visitor in studio. I have Watchdog. This is a guy who does a very amazing job pale YouTube. If you haven't seen mm -hmm. his work, I'm going to link so that you can go and see. Should I call him a social media CID or do I call him a YouTube CID? You're going to find that in a few minutes. Akohapa, Karibu Sana Watchdog, how are you? I'm good, thank you so much. Uh huh. Yes. So for the person who is viewing you for the very first time here at Miran TV, because it's a pleasure me hosting you for the very first time. So if you can just briefly introduce yourself. <laughs> Yo, ladies and gentlemen, come okay, come on, come on, truth watchdog, come on. Na leto kweli ka dam kipenda mna meza mkikata tuna mmezesha. Mm -hmm. Kwani iko nini na tukona ka evidence. Ukweli au temu, ukweli unasemwa. Hivyo ndio kuna endaga. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is truth watchdog. Mm -hmm. Um I'm a Kenyan. Yes. Born and bred in Kenya. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know whether to identify myself as a content creator mm -hmm. or to identify myself as an informational dispenser. Mhm. Mm because what I do is information that is real. I don't script my information. Everything that I put out there, it's what is happening or what will happen or what just happened. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that is what I am all about, Truth Watchdog. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wow, okay. So Watchdog, if you know, yep. and uh, this is because there is a story I covered Okay. Yeah, and I saw you have also done the same story. So basically, you know, as content creators, we do create content in different parts. Yani bora ni content, we just go to create true. the content. True. So we don't know if it's true or it's false. So later on, it's probably when you start hearing things about it. So the instance is about the story that was covered by, you know, True K. Yes. And I also covered it. And then later on, so you had done uh, about the same story, Ukisema, there are some things that had disparities. So maybe if you can just tell us maybe Tuanze na true case story and Moha classic. So are you saying that whatever they covered about Amos was not uh, true or? Yeah, we, we start with who? Choose choose any. We can start with uh, true case. Uh, based on what story? Specifically based on true the case? story he did about Amos, Cheryl, the wedding that trended. Yes. Yes, there's the wedding that he covered, him and Moha Classic. They covered, you know, they did the loyalty test at the wedding. Now he cut trend sana. And uh, so from there, of course, people have been talking about it. Oh, yeah, the wedding. Yeah, the wedding. That is purely fake. Mm. Let me, I, I'm not going to mix my word. Yeah. Uh, words. The wedding thing was all fake. Mm -hmm. There was no wedding at all. Mm -hmm. Uh... It was all scripted. That is what we call. You know, in a, in a script, I can come here and say, you are my wife. And you say, yeah, baby. You know? Yet, in real sense, on the ground, it is us who have agreed that we are going to show people how a couple should address each other and stuff. Mm -hmm. That does not mean that in real sense, you are my wife. So, that, uh, that whole thing, mm. it means it's scripted. The first thing you want to, to understand. Yes. In whose wedding mm -hmm. will anyone come with cameras mm -hmm. to confirm if you are cheating or not cheating? Mm -hmm. In a wedding, yet the pastors and the rest of the people are waiting for you. Mm -hmm. the, uh, during wedding, muna kwa gana camera manuenyu. Muna kwa gana mtuwa video, mtuwa photos. Wana kwa gasha jipanga yo team. So any other person to come out, a strange person, that they want to do loyalty test mm -hmm. in a wedding. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Unless, unless that man is Anganudia mm. or that lady, I don't know what kind of an element we can call you. Mm. If you know you are cheating on your wedding day, that is the last thing you want someone to talk about. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. It's obvious. So us finding like uh, at Mohali Patua so much time pale, kwenda kufanya interview, wasoka achana, then where were the parents? Mm. Because I don't know. Simuliona kulikuwa na arusi ya nyako, uh, anatisi nyako, anato nani? Ako the, mm. we ask the same thing, mm -hmm. where are the parents to the msungu? Mm -hmm. Aya, sayi kwa api? <laughs> because you people watch a lot of dramas. Mm -hmm. And dramas are, are meant, for example, to remain relevant mm -hmm. in the media realm. And it's okay, mm -hmm. we don't say that is wrong. Mm -hmm. 
the only thing is when you think that uh, things are very much true and people think like oh liaribia ndo ya msewe ni msembaya not really hakuna ndo iliaribiwa huyo msa anaitwa kush in fact if i took my uh, my phone from my manager there mm. you'll check he's asking me to promote him why mm. because the guy is trending mm. his channel is stuck mm-hmm. the person who's supposed to promote him is who it's moha mm-hmm. because yeah amenda machapa kipindi kwa moha classic ame grow moha classic sana it's all it's only right for moha mm. to also appreciate this guy by promoting his channel mm-hmm. not him now again coming to me mm-hmm. to say hey bro ni promote your channel manze tumeanza podcast ingine tumeanza kushoot vipindi mm-hmm. kaona za ni support no i'm not supposed to be doing that mm-hmm. so i'm supposed to promote kush mm-hmm. the guy who has trended in millions of uh, views to grow his channel mm-hmm. while when you mtumia wali hepa he never had any wedding there is no wedding hakwa mm-hmm. yacha kazi yote furthermore he's not a doctor mm-hmm. he claims to be a doctor it's in acting he's a doctor in acting mm-hmm. yes he's a doctor but in real life he has never been a doctor anywhere mm-hmm. none not even practitioner hakuna mm-hmm. mm-hmm. so yote ni kipindi hakuna ukweli hapo mm-hmm. i can ascertain this and uh, i would ask wakati kuna kwa na wedding si before wedding kuna ile mahari melipwa mm-hmm. tuende tuende kwa kila demo atuonyeshe ndio hii mahari ilitolewa mm-hmm. hakuna kitu kaya it was all acting mm-hmm. even the parents that were later intru- uh, introduced where were they when the wedding was taking place mm-hmm. you can't tell me you forgot your parents mm-hmm. during your d day mm-hmm. alafu sasa wakati kumetokea mushkil that's when your mother is coming on set doesn't make sense at all see the parents were in the reception area did you see them they didn't show us the reception then because there was no reception because if there was a reception mm. you could see kawaida tu camera camera iko na kierehere hata wewe unajua you would walk and see the kinds of food the setup the cake is of it is mm. but that is too much expensive for acting locally mm-hmm. no no so the thing was gari kam how many vehicles did you see mm. i think several i think several, several vehicles yeah. no how many vehicles did you see with flowers and stuff uh, i think one one yeah which wedding Yaani wasi wamesota mpaka mwezi yeka ribbons kwa magari saba peke yake. Mnaeka kwa gari moja hivi ribbon. Mhm. Wacha kutubeba ufala sio wedding ungefanya kwa ndizi huko. <laughs> Hata unge save food, unge save pesa mnaenda kuzaa mm. school fees. It was all a joke. There is no way unajua unajua kama nimekaa na gari. Yes. Na nielewe bro unafanya wedding. Mm. So nitajitolea hata mimi mwenyewe nikwambia ah bro don't worry. Mimi mm. nitajiwekea ma ribbons, nitafuel ndai yangu kazi yangu ni kopale ku support mm-hmm. so you want to tell me the seven vehicles mm-hmm. okay the six vehicles yeah. man as the one which had ribbons mm-hmm. our watu wote pia wote walikuwa wamesota wako na tuma gari ziko pale those were parked vehicles and they were not part of this wedding thing mm-hmm. mimi hata naweza shuka hapa chini umeona magari pale ndapiga pitch up mm-hmm. and say this is my vehicle mm-hmm. kwa camera this is my vehicle yeah. reality mm-hmm. labda hata nimefukuzu hapo toyu jinga hapo kabisa wewe So mimi nataka kukata hiyo party ya Toyo. Alafu naacha this is my vehicle guys, you know God has blessed me. <laughs> It's amazing we are doing work. Uh-huh. That is what uh, is coming up with this media pressure. Yeah. And it's unfortunate. Mm. Okay? Mm-hmm. But vipindi is allowed. Mm-hmm. For that one I had no problem with them yeah. until they started now doing some funny things and fundraising. Mm-hmm. That's when Truth Watchdog came in. Mm-hmm. Otherwise I have uh, I have known all along. Najua watu wa vipindi wengi sana. I haven't mentioned to them because they haven't stolen from Kenyans. Mm-hmm. You steal from Kenya, you steal from me, you become my business. I expose you. Okay. Yep. Wow. So, okay, yeah, you said you know a lot of people are vipindi but you've never uh, spoken about them kwa sababu yes. hawajai be Kenyans. So probably in this specific matter, ni wapi ili touch ili kufikia uka feel no. Now this one I have to talk about it. When exactly? Moha uh. lied to people that he had a head surgery. Mhm. And then when did you where have you ever heard that a surgery head surgery heals within four days mm-hmm. you are home eating githeri stop mm-hmm. it's not possible mm-hmm. how can you eat githeri with a head surgery <laughs> <laughs> my friend twaje ujinga yeah. okay mm-hmm. Because, let me tell you unaona kifanywa head surgery hata mm-hmm. kuchiu yes. it's difficult mm-hmm. the next thing that you experience inakwanga kuvura sura Mm. Mohaja vura sura. 
Mm-hmm. Then four days I'm at and you are hang out Ramadan and acheka. You can't laugh with a head surgery. Mm-hmm. Eating is a problem. How can you laugh? You know? Yes. And now that is not the problem. Uh-huh. You acting, you had a head surgery. Mm-hmm. The problem was they are now asking for funds from people to support them pay or clear hospital bills. Mm-hmm. That is where the problem now started. Mm-hmm. So when the problem started, I went ahead to prove to people, including this wedding, it's a fake. Mm-hmm. I know this guy. He has never had a wedding. Ata pesa ya mahari, sayu kimuambia toe hana. Alifanyaje wedding. Sayu ni mekukatia, ni mekuingiza box. Nataka kukuwa. I must know your parents or at least your relatives. Mm-hmm. I must go and say I am the one with the lady. And this is what I'm giving. We think of wedding. We have that due process. Muniambie, tuenda kwa ushaka ukeno demu, mwonyesha mahari ndio hile, hili tolewa. Nothing. But that was not the case. The case was, bro, why are you lying to people? They are fundraising. Now what, unajua wase wa diaspora. Mm-hmm. Especially, tunaitanga kina mama ama wa shana wa gulf. Yes. Kuna wengine walienda Europe by mistake. Kuna pata msea kwa Europe ama US. Mm-hmm. Lakini kiongolo jia kisomo wakuna. Mm-hmm. Cleaning tu ndio hiko, unona? Mm-hmm. So ya nafanya maybe ma cleaning huko. Mm-hmm fear carrying and stuff mm-hmm. so ana make ka pesa kake kakubwa lakini hapo hivi eh, the moment in a read degrees ya hapo negative zero in terms of education so ama demo kionezi vipindi oh mimi mtu hizi ni arabia rusi yangu mimi yaki <coughs> mimi naweza kuwa mtu unaua nani the thing is our join acting because our so ujue kwa our say what all the loyalty test and these vipindis they never say that this is for the entertainment purposes they don't even know that actually it's a professional courtesy to tell people whatever you're seeing here is meant for entertainment. They just post it. We ujibu venye utajibu, question venye uta question it's upon you. Unaona? Hakuna movie yote imeaktiwa bila script my dear. Every movie there must be people sitting behind the camera writing, directing. Sunaona kama hapa kuna watu wa camera, kuna watu wa light, kuna watu wa sound. All these people they are making just one ka small video mm-hmm. for people to see out there mm-hmm. whatever happened behind the camera it's only you who is seen behind the camera mm-hmm. and whatever will be seen in the camera it's you who decides what will be displayed on the screen for people to see mm-hmm. and what will not be displayed yeah. you see mm-hmm. so the discrepancies in the, within the video of fundraising uh-huh. even the type of hospital mm-hmm. my friend ini <laughs> usigani <laughs> Ati ati head surgery unashughulikiwa na daktari mmoja mm. hivi. Ah. Yaani sasa tuseme yes. wazungu ni mafala sana. That's why they have to be six five people. Mm. All of them give me the scalpel, give me the scissors, give me the needle. Wewe daktari mmoja unakuja kufanya head surgery mmoja hivi. Mm. Uko na mkono 10. Hmm? You are a spider mm. now. You can operate on one. So all that was 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 a stupid joke mm-hmm. and i pity especially the people in europe and us mm. you've seen the facilities in terms of health centers mm-hmm. and then an idiot comes from kibera in a krokocho hospital mm-hmm. tells you they are having a head surgery and you're fundraising for that mm-hmm. so sad so sad so you with yao ikafanya sad to expose mbaka pale nyuma wamejifanya wame have a head accidents by them how many kwa na accidents mingi za kichwa before pia mm. kuna time pia amekuwa kiwete kwa video ya Brighton mm-hmm. sasa jamaa anatembea na mgu mbili kwani miracle inafanyika wapi zitupeleke wagonjwa real tutoe kenyata watu moha letea wale watu wako mm. wafanye kitu hapo mm-hmm. so he forgets the ideas he has already used mm-hmm. and then he, he he tries to refurbish them unfortunately they just land in the wrong uh, crowd ya viewership mm-hmm. na get mm-hmm. so it's so unfortunate that mohasi says it ambia kitu ni muongo na please it is my words blame me ni muizi he's a con man and a scammer mm-hmm. yes that is what he is okay. there was no fundraising mm-hmm. uh, there was no there was no head surgery at all mm-hmm. say kana tembea kako free head surgery it means that there is cuttings show me the scar hauna mm-hmm. scar kwani walifanya surgery gani what is that technology that kenya has acquired before the first world countries mm. Mm. Nyo, nyo, nyo. <laughs> okay so for, before we continue maybe i can just say we are right now uh coming live from 
Cream Shield Studios. This is an amazing studio. You know, when you need your videos done, when you need to take your pictures, it's a very perfect place, and even for podcasts. You can come here, do your videos. They have several spaces that you can work from. Just come, and uh, they'll lead you and show you the space. Of course, I'm going to link the their link down here, and uh, I'm going to give you all the details so that you can go and check them out, and also subscribe to their YouTube channel. Uh, let's get them to... How many subscribers? <laughs> Let us get them to 5,000 subscribers. You need to get your mom too. You need to get your mom too. Who subscribe? Kabisa, it's completely free. Mm.